and welcome to the San Siro here in Milan. Home to both AC Milan and Internazionale and the venue for the 2016 Champions League final. It has been a long journey to one of the greatest events in football, the UEFA Champions League final, now just moments away. And so the distinctive sound of the UEFA Champions League anthem. So, just who will seize their moment? Well, this is a great day for the Champions Cup final. It's contested here, it's got to be played to a finish, and hopefully it will live up to the occasion, Alan. I think so, I think it will, Martin. I hope we rise to the occasion in the way that I think the players will have here today. Let's go between the 2013 Copa del Rey final, when... Uh, Simeone's side beat Mourinho's Madrid. Well, indeed, and they've been going places up in recent years, in 2014, so looking forward to this one. Let's get Madrid make one change. Stefan Savic plays with Diego Godin as the centre-backs. Coque starts with Yannick Ferreira Carrasco in the wide positions. They've got plenty of goal threat with two strikers in the attack. This is the Real Madrid lineup. Cabajal starts with Marcelo as the full-backs. Cristiano Ronaldo starts a midfielder in good form. Karim Benzema is the lone striker today. Olympic Stadium here in Rome, rightly called an Olympic Stadium, it had an Olympics here in 1960. Of course, it's not changed too much since then. No, it's one of those stadiums quite hard to get into, they put a ring of steel around it, but uh, they've had some great games. Remember visiting here for Italia 90 a as a supporter. Nothing wrong with that tackle, ball won cleanly. Hammers dashing forward at pace. Looking to force his way through. Goal! Real Madrid! Could that be the start of something big? And a trademark move ends with the inevitable classy finish. Look, if you want to be effective on the break, then the key element is always pace. That's what really rips the fences apart. And it's difficult to find an answer to it when it's applied like that. Okay. And in goes the cross. And in comes the header. What a header! And what a goal! It's come off the forehead really solidly. Keeper, no chance for that one. Well, I want to see this again, this goal. Modric does well to read it and intercepts. Oh, he's broken through. Yeah, he's pulled him up for that challenge. And he's going to have his name taken. Well, the players are making their point, but the ref clearly isn't interested. He's waved them all away. Koke! Oh, what a goal! Sumptuous finish, an absolute joy! Unbelievable. Well, we're all back to square one, but I hope this game opens up from here. It looks as if it could happen. Dispatched expertly, nicely done.
Benzema. It's a passing game. And my word, they're passing it well here. Ronaldo, and that levels it up, it's a goal. within that camp, the great team spirit, and it's seen them well. Fernando Torres plays it out to the wing. Fernando Torres. Modric plays the route one option. And there goes the final whistle. Real Madrid collect the greatest prize in club football. Theirs is this famous trophy. They are champions of Europe. So on to centre stage come the central characters. The individuals who, as a team, blended into champions, and this is their moment. 